Now, making a top 10 list of the top villains of all time is not easy. I mean, there are so many villains to choose from. Villains that appear in television shows, movies, comic books. Hell, there even are villains in real life. Well, there are some real life people that are labeled as villains or whatever. But anyway, since I am a big movie fan and I do watch a lot of television shows, there are so many villains to choose from. If you disagree with me, I respect your opinion 100%. But this is my list of my personal favorite villains. So here comes the list of my top 10 favorite villains. Enjoy! Number 10, Noah Bennett from the television show Heroes. Well, although he isn't directly a villain, I felt like putting him on here because he has done some bad things. Yeah, I will admit, he is not the biggest villain of the television show Heroes. There are are bigger villains of that show. But he w was involved in the program to take away people with supernatural abilities in volume 4 or season 3 of Heroes. Now that's bad ass. He has done many bad things. And that's why I felt like putting him on there. Number 9. Montgomery Burns. Now, I'm not really a big Simpsons fan. In fact, I think the Simpsons has gotten shittier from season 12. But I will tell you this. Montgomery Burns still remains my favorite Simpsons character. I mean, he isn't just a, a trillionaire. He is also an evil trillionaire. It is revealed quite often in the Simpsons that he is in fact evil. And it's not really clear to see it straight away that he is evil. And that's what makes him so great. Number 8. Cyrus from the Pokemon series. Cyrus wants to destroy the Pokemon world and create a new one. Now that's selfish greedy. And that's what makes Cyrus such a great villain. He doesn't give up. He does everything he can to destroy the Pokemon world and create a new one. Now, that's what I'd call a true villain. That's truly evil, and that's why he deserves to be on this list. Giovanni from the Pokemon series. Now, the reason why I put Giovanni in here is because he is the leader of Team Rocket. And Team Rocket is a bad, bad gang and how Giovanni handles his members that's truly bad 
is the one remains my favorite villain from the Pokemon anime and for good reasons he is a bad ass and truly belongs on this list number six the Joker now personally I like the Joker played by Jack Nicholson a lot more than I like the Joker played by Heath Ledger don't get me wrong folks the Joker played by Heath Ledger did a fucking fantastic job and so did Jack Nicholson now the reason why I like the Joker played by Jack Nicholson more than the Joker played by Heath Ledger is because to me the Joker played by Jack Nicholson is, is crazier than the Joker played by Heath Ledger Anyway, the reason why the Joker is on this list is because he's so unpredictable. And that's what makes the Joker great. The things that the Joker does, it's so unpredictable. And that's why he belongs on this list. Number five. Lex Luthor now what I like about Lex Luthor is that he wants to do everything he can to get Superman and he stops at nothing to get him and he has creative ways of trying to get Superman and that's what makes Lex Luthor truly a great villain. Number four, Gargamel from the Smurfs. Now Gargamel doesn't give up. He wants the Smurfs so badly. And he does everything he can to get them. Gargamel is a dark wizard who never gives up to get the Smurfs, no matter how difficult it is. And that's what makes him such a great villain. Number three, Freddy Krueger. He kills people in their nightmare. If he kills them in their nightmare, they die in real life. And that's what makes Freddy Krueger such a great villain. And that's why he belongs on this list. Number two, Barbas, the demon of fear from Charmed. He kills people with their fears. Yeah. And that's bad is and that's why Barbas the demon of fear belongs on this list number one Jafar that's right Jafar is my favorite villain and the reason for that is he doesn't just kill his enemy he does more than just that he Make sure that this enemy, Aladdin, suffers badly when he dies. And that's what makes Jafar so great. He is creative in his evil plans. And he doesn't just kill Aladdin, he lets him suffer and that's what makes him such a great villain and that's what makes him my top favorite villain and that's my list of top 10 villains of all time now i'm sure there are many villains that i didn't include in this video well there are so many villains to choose from that it's impossible to include them all in one video so yeah tell me guys 
What did you think of this list? Do you agree with me on those villains being bad? Yes. Or do you disagree with me? Please leave your thoughts in the comment section. And if you disagree with me, that's okay. I respect everyone's opinions. So yeah. Until next time, thank you for watching and have a great day.